Hello guys, welcome back to the channel and in this very demo, let's start with fixing the copy and paste. We need to use wget to pull out this from virtualbox.org, which is vbox guest additions 6.1.6.iso. So we're going to hit the enter key. So we're trying to contact virtualbox.org. All right. So the virtualbox guest edition is downloaded. And the next thing to do now would be to make a directory. So here I'm going to do make there and then media slash ISO. So let's make a directory. So make directory. We're going to put it here uh, media slash ISO. Okay. So the next thing to do now will be to mount it. So in order to do so, we're going to say mount uh, VBox guest additions uh, underscore 6.1.6.iso. We're going to mount it inside the media slash ISO for shaded directory. So we're going to do mount, I'll just type here, mount. Okay, so V box uh, guest additions. So this will be six point one point six dot ISO. So going to mount it now media slash ISO directory. Okay, so that's uh, pretty much what we need to do here. And hit the enter key. And yeah, so it's mounted and it's saying that is a uh, read only. Okay, so we are fine. So now I'm going to cd into that location cd slash media slash iso let's see what we have got inside that directory so we've got a couple of um, stuff here so looking for vbox linux additions dot run this very one here so let me see if i can copy and paste and so we we'll just have to run that guy all right yeah why for yes all right so at this point i'm going to reboot once again the machine has come up so i just opened another terminal so let me open it again okay so let's say i copy this from my laptop a notepad on my laptop and right click here and paste and that's pretty much it so i have been able to copy from my system uh, which is my laptop okay so those are the steps that i took to fix this guy just in case you've been installing some stuff to get a uh, copy and paste working once you make sure that the shared clipboard and the drag and drop are set to bidirectional uh, use this command to remove whatever it is you may have installed before now Maybe you've installed VirtualBox Guest 11 or DKMS or Tails. When you are done removing those guys, you're going to reboot your Kali and then you're going to download this. So wget, you go to virtualbox.org and you're going to be downloading VirtualBox Guest Edition 6.1.6.iso. Yeah, you are going to make a directory and we name this guy Media iso and then we'll mount it and the next thing we'll do is to cd into that location and uh, you can actually do ls if you like to see what we've got inside that location and the one we are running is the vbox linux additions uh we'll just run that guy and one more time reboot your machine and that's it you should be able to copy and paste in your 2025.1 kali linux